A car starts from rest and moves with a uniform acceleration of 5 meter per second square for 8 seconds. If the acceleration ceases after 8 seconds then find the distance covered in 12 seconds starting from rest. In this question initially car starts from rest. Initial velocity of the car is equals to 0 meter per second. Acceleration of the car is 5 meter per second square. But this acceleration is acting only 8 seconds. Time is equals to 8 seconds. By using this, find out the final velocity of the car after 8 seconds. Take equation of motion. V equals to U plus AT. V is equals to 0 plus 5 into 8. Final velocity of the car after 8 seconds is 40 meter per second. But after 8 seconds acceleration is a seizures. That means acceleration is equals to 0 after 8 seconds. Now we have to find out the distance covered in 12 seconds starting from rest. Initially car starts from rest. U is equals to 0. After 8 seconds velocity of the car becomes to 40 meter per second. But the total journey time of the car is 12 seconds. Already 8 seconds completed here. The remaining time is 4 seconds. So after getting 0 acceleration this car is moving in next 4 seconds also. So here from starting to 12 seconds we have to find out the distance. In 8 seconds distance travelled by the car S1 is equals to ut plus half at square. This term is 0. Half into acceleration 5 and the time is 8 seconds. 8 whole square. Half into 5 into 8 HR 64. 2 3s, 2 2s. 5 2s are 10. 5 3 is 15. 15 plus 1 16. 160 meters. In first to 8 seconds, the distance travelled by the car is 160 meters. And in next to 4 seconds, T2 is equals to 4 seconds. So in next to 4 seconds, the initial velocity of the car becomes to 40 meter per second. There is no acceleration. Acceleration is equals to 0. So distance travelled by the car is equals to speed into time. Speed into time. This speed is nothing but the final velocity at the end of the 8 seconds. This velocity is 40 and time is 4. 160 meters. So in first 8 seconds distance travelled by the car is 160 meters. In next to 4 seconds when acceleration is 0 then also the distance travelled by the car is 160 meters. So total distance travelled by the car S equals to S1 plus S2 160 plus 160 that is equals to 320 meters.